Dragon Ball Z was originally called Dragon Ball 2, but due to an editing mistake, uh, it was thought to be a Z and it was never changed. So basically somebody went to go write Dragon Ball 2 on a piece of paper and it accidentally looked like a Z instead of a 2. And they were like, okay, we'll just roll with that. So it stayed Z and nobody ever changed it back. Fact number 2. Tarble is the only full-blooded and canon Saiyan that is never killed, still has a tail, and cannot transform into a, er, and did not transform into a Super Saiyan throughout the entire series. Him being the only one who still has a tail also means he's the only one who can achieve grade 8 form anymore. I thought that was kind of interesting. Fact number 3. Tyler the Great Warrior. Tyler was a young kid who was diagnosed with a form of liver cancer. Along with that, he kind of had a couple other problems with his intestines and he was um, at the doctors and he got he got accepted for the Make-A-Wish Foundation and for his Make-A-Wish Foundation Tyler was a very big Yu-Gi-Oh fan and four kids actually came in and they let him design his own Yu-Gi-Oh card now you may be wondering Thundershot this is a top 10 Dragon Ball list why are you talking about Yu-Gi-Oh well the design that Tyler chose for his Tyler the Great Warrior card is actually based off of Future Trunks as a Super Saiyan as you can see on the picture here I thought that was very interesting, and just so you guys know, Tyler did make it out of surgery okay, and he's cancer-free. Fact number four. King Kai admits during the Cell Saga that uh, while the Saiyan Saga was taking place, King Kai knew the instant transmission technique, and he could have taught Goku, but Goku never asked him. Had King Kai taught Goku, Goku may have been able to instant transmission back in time to face the Saiyans and save Piccolo, Tien, Chiaotzu, and Yamcha's lives. Not to mention having them in the fight against Vegeta and Nappa probably would have came in pretty handy. Scumbag King Kai. Fact number 5. During the Cell Saga, despite Perfect Cell spitting out 7 Cell Juniors, Super Saiyan 2 Teen Gohan is seen destroying 8 of them. This could be a kind of continuity error, or a Cell Jr. could have used the multi-form technique while we weren't looking or off screen or whatever, but it's probably a continuity error. I thought that was neat though, if you go back and you pull up the episode where Gohan kills all the Cell Juniors, he, you do, you see Cell spit out 7 of them and then Gohan kills 8, I thought that was neat. Fact number 6, in the very first episode of Dragon Ball, or while introduced in the Dragon Ball manga, Goku is 12 years old, and he looks like this. Much later down the road in Dragon Ball Z, this is an 11 year old Gohan seen coming out of the hyperbolic time chamber for the first time. Also, it's interesting to note that they were voiced by the same people. Young Goku from Dragon Ball uh, was voiced by the same person who voiced Gohan from his trial days all the way to the end of the Cell Saga. Fact number 7. The person who actually killed Captain Ginyu was Kid Buu. Ginyu, as we know, was turned into a frog and he hopped around on Namek for a while. He changed bodies with Bulma, then he changed back, we know that. And then, uh, due to a wish, when they wish that everyone go from Namek to Earth except for Goku and Frieza, Captain Ginyu, as a frog, also went to Earth. And on Earth, he, re he remained a frog until his death during the destruction of the planet brought on by Kid Buu. So when Kid Buu blew up planet Earth, uh, Captain Ginyu's long, weird adventure ended there. <laughs> Fact number eight. Tien and Nappa both have or had hair at one point in time. Nappa is seen in the episode of Bardock with a mohawk, which he apparently shaved off. Just when I thought he couldn't get any uglier, they show, they show us this picture of Nappa with a mohawk. And Tien has hair, but he regularly shaves it himself. Fact number 9. Vegeta is almost always seen addressing Goku by his Saiyan birth name Kakarot. He uses the name Goku only 8 times in the entire series. And finally, fact number 10. Goku's family actually made a small career for themselves as radish farmers. Up until the Cell Saga, that is, when Hercule Satan paid Goku's family a very large fortune for allowing him to take credit for the victory over Cell. This happens again following the Majin Buu Saga when Hercule's allowed to take credit for that.